Carly. It's so good to see you. It's good to see you too. Oh, I'm so excited today because we're going to make this video where we're going to talk about your 100 pound weight loss in a mere eight months and three days. I mean, it's been absolutely amazing to work with you. Why don't we start with you telling me where you were when we first talked? I had had two ankle surgeries, one that totally reconstructed my ankle. So that's kind of where I started gaining the weight and just gained and gained. And my new career was very physically demanding. It was hard to do my job sometimes. I would leave totally exhausted, my feet hurt. It was all I could do just to get home and go to bed. I was just tired of being tired. It was just time. I, I feel like something just finally clicked in my mind. You know, a little bit about the, the way that we work together. We did it through text message support and a once a month phone call. Mm -hmm. And what did that what did that do for you in terms of the change really happening? Knowing I had someone there um, that I could text whenever I needed to. I think just knowing I had someone there to hold me accountable and I kept my food log and sent it to her religiously. And that is really the ticket. I yes. know a lot of people think that they're exempt from logging. And I think to really get into the subconscious and to make the change and make the changes permanent, I'm just a big fan of that food log. It is the, the magic ticket. Yes, it is, yeah. for sure. And I will say, I think on the weeks that you didn't keep your food log, you weren't losing, or no. at least not as much. No, and when I wasn't, <laughs> yeah, when I wasn't following Catherine's advice to a T, I wasn't losing. Yeah. I just wasn't. Yeah. You really just sailed through an astronomical amount of weight loss. Uh, and I mean, obviously, you've gone through a couple sets of clothing. I mean, we're petite, so 100 yes. pounds on someone who's 5'2 mm -hmm. is a lot different than 100 pounds on someone who's 6'5. Yeah. You know, what was that like psychologically for you? Like, to me, replacing your entire wardrobe a couple of times in eight months. That had to be yeah. a lot to go through. So I would really, what I would do is I would just go in, I would get the number that I thought I would be in, and then usually it was a size below is what I needed. That was motivating in itself. Yeah. You know, sometimes people are so overwhelmed when you know you've got to lose 50 or 80 or 100 pounds that it's just hard to even take the first step. And it's really hard to stay on track. So what would you say to the people that are that are struggling and in that place? I just took it one day at a time. Um, I really just stayed focused and used your advice. And when I got frustrated, I had people I could reach out to and say, look, I'm stuck. What can I do? They just said, just follow the process, stick to the plan, and it'll come off. When you want change, you're gonna go through some emotional, cartwheels in order to get what you want out of the process. Absolutely. And it was hard sometimes when everyone around me is eating pizza and ice cream and because I did I started this right before Christmas time and so the hardest time of all. Yeah. Yeah. And um, I stayed to the plan all through Christmas. And you just did your first triathlon. Oh my gosh, how is that even possible? I know and I actually I told my dad when I crossed the finish line I said or he actually said to me, you couldn't have done this a year ago. I was like, there's no way, there's no way. And it was just my morning workout. I mean, it was a little tougher than a regular workout, but I mean, it really wasn't yeah. anything that I didn't feel like I, I can't get through this. That, I knew I could. That is amazing. That is amazing. You've made such a huge transformation on all levels. You've actually been able to go on and help some other people with yeah. their transformation. It's been awesome. That in itself is so rewarding. Just having people come to me and say, okay, well, what do you think about this? Right, right. And there's so many little questions. Yeah. And I, I know what to tell them. I'm confident that it's like, that's where so many people get frustrated. They think they're making good choices and they're not. My biggest joy is when you come to me and say, oh gosh, my client is down 14 pounds and, and counting. And, and then you get those rewarding text messages. Mm -hmm. I mean, to me, that is that is really the, the real meaning of simple fat burn that anyone can do this. It's it's simple. It's and me and my dad say this all the time. It's not always easy, but it's simple. Like I know exactly what I have to do to be where I want to be. Yeah. And you know, if I start to stray off plan a little bit, I just get right back on. Yeah. And yeah. it's no big deal. I definitely want to expand my nutrition coaching, um, take on new clients, and. Um, and I think you're going to help a lot of people along yes. the way. Yes. <laughs> All right. Well, thank you for, for sharing this, and, and we're excited to share it with, with everyone in the world. So. Absolutely. Well, thank you for everything. Great. Thank you. <laughs>